Be honest. <laughs> I'm trying to think of something. <laughs> you won't hurt their feelings. <coughs> I'm really trying to think of something. The hardest part is, I would say it's the fact that um, everyone's exploring a very new concept. So um, we, we fail a lot, but then at least we, we keep failing forward. So the hardest part is the fact that it's a very exploratory thing. So of course you'll find some um, haggles along the way, but um, we've been failing fast and forward. To any degree, it's the fact that it helps you be a little more informed about um, the, the realities that could be predicted based on the data that, we, um, that we've sourced for this. So um, to have an idea of what um, the implications of incidents such as um, decrease in food security and conflict and what that does to um, population displacement, um, I think, yeah, it's, it's very helpful in that sense. Um, so user experience design is essentially um, making sure that uh, solutions or products or services um, work best for the people um, they're designed for. So um, if you want to introduce a new product to the market or a new service or add a feature to an existing product, um, user experience design um, assists you in that you will solve a problem for the actual users of your platform or your service and it will give them be the best experience with your product. And the reason why it's important um, now more than ever is that we're on the brink of what is touted as the fourth industrial revolution and there's lots of technologies that are being introduced and it's very important to onboard people and help contextualize um, new, new ideas for them.